my name is Carlo. Are we gonna be, uh, today we're gonna make a uh, mussels appetizer. The mussels that I'm gonna use today, they're gonna be Prince Edward Island mussels. And I chose this kind of mussels because they are cultivated, therefore they are clean, they go to a process, and they're nice and clean. And I'll be honest with you, 95% of the mussels used in the United States, they come from Prince Edward Island. Now, we're gonna saute a little bit of garlic in oil, extra virgin olive oil, and we're gonna put the mussels in. A little bit of salt and pepper. Now, the steam, it will let them open up. If you notice, I didn't put any water. You should not use any water whatsoever. Just a little bit of uh, uh, extra virgin olive oil and garlic. In a separate pan, I'm gonna cook, and again, a little bit of uh, extra virgin olive oil. I'm gonna use shallots. A little bit of celery. Scallions. Let them cook a little bit. You add the bacon. Now, different than the pancetta, the bacon is smoked. Now, to make this dish, I'm using two ingredients that we are very unusual for mussels, and is a touch of vermouth. That's a dry vermouth, of course. And to taper off the taste of the salt and the pepper in the bacon, I use a little bit of coconut milk. Now you will notice that it has a very distinctive taste when you eat it, and now we combine everything together. The mussels and the sauce that I made on the side. Now you can use this as an appetizer or you can de-shell the mussels and you can put it over linguine or over pinne pasta and you can use it as a main course. And this is your appetizer. Right here. And of course, with a nice glass of wine, you have either your main course or your appetizer. Salute.